So we're out here trying to get the 240 better. Replacing some hoses with messed up clamps. That had a messed up clamp and it was cracked. Uh, we couldn't find the noise, but the head looked like a little worn down from something like repeatedly hitting it. But we're just gonna cut this down and attach it right there. Change the oil and go get some breakfast. All right, we got the valve cover. We checked the the gears under there. We got the new filter in with the oil, some washer fluid, and then Walmart boned me. I bought this mirror, and how do they how do they expect you to stick it to the window with a piece of metal? Glue it on. Man. There's nothing in there, so we're gonna get some double-sided tape in the garage if we can find it and slap it on. And some breakfast. Breakfast. That's all right. Out here in the vert. So we're on our way to pick up some. We're gonna put the vert to a little like, test today and see how reliable it is. Our trip there and and then an hour back. So We'll see. Let's see how she does. You can see because this thing is so good like this. I can't stand it. It's like yeah. an Evo 8 or a car or something. So that should be sick. Oh yeah. Alright. So this piece wouldn't stay up. So we bought some super glue. And we're on the highway right now and we're going to try and put the mirror on. Find a parking lot or something to put her in. Throw her in because the seat's so. Cool. Probably just leave this seat on the side of the road somewhere because who cares? We'll see. We'll see. Here at Dunkin' Donuts. Dude, where are the tools? Install this sick seat. First, we gotta get this one out. Like filming. Alright, so we got the Recaro in. It's good enough for the ride home. These two bolts didn't line up this one and the back one, but we're just gonna send Wait. it. Word. But it's an Evo Recaro, and yeah, we're just gonna send it home now. All right, test out the old vert. I'm gonna try a little rip. Nope. A little twifty. <laughs> so. New day, I picked up some tail lights last night. This one's not bad as that little crack right there, but it's fine. I picked up this one. This is Hoonigan, I'm just gonna take some paint thinner to it, but. That one was all messed up, as you can see. So, picked up a. Shotsy, using that hook. Uh, we got the valve cover off. We're still trying to figure out this kit. If you come in close and look at how messed up this head is, right here. Look at that. Oh yeah. So, if I can just figure out this tick for now, I'm getting a new motor soon, and then when is soon? Five speed. When is soon? When is soon? This. So we just got this front cover off. Just popped it loose with the screwdriver. This motor looks just nasty inside. Look at how black all of this is. And when yeah, I pulled gross. off the cover, it just smelled like burnt oil. It's coming off. <laughs> well, sadly, it's all back together. And that guy didn't fix it, so. We're just gonna have to send it with that tick till I get the new motor. Cause I'm not buying a new tent. Fuck them. All right, they're gonna take this thing for a ride after the alignment. See if it's all good. Hopefully, it's good. How was it? 
How was it? Good. This motor lasted a solid week. He's done. <laughs> Headlights work though. So. I'll get it. I don't even know if it'll start. Can you pop the hood? <laughs> Rip. <laughs> Some piece of hurt. <laughs> <laughs>